Okay, here we are featuring our new release called Electric Power from iPhone.LaRoseWeb.com. As you can see, we have our new website up uh, featuring our apps called iEngineerApps.com. Uh, let's take a look at the new application we have here. As you can see, we have um, <clears throat> multi-tab selections down the bottom where we have uh, direct current, alternating current one phase, alternating current two phase, alternating current three phase, then we have a more button over here where you can select uh, three phase starters, voltage drop, and the power factor correction calculations. Let's go back and first take a look at the direct current tab. Uh, you have your selections of uh, calculating the amps using horsepower, KW, and or finding out your KW or horsepower Let's take a look at the first one. All you have to do is punch in your voltage, your efficiency, horsepower, and hit the calc button, and there you go. <clears throat> uh, same thing for all these different applications. And you just navigate back and forth. Um, here we have the uh, AC single phase. Punch in your voltage, amps, efficiency, power factor, and it'll calculate your horsepower and same thing for the two-phase and three-phase AC. Let's take a look at the uh, applications we have here under the more button. We have uh, three-phase starters. And as you can see we have listed based on what you have selected for the motor horsepower and your voltage. Uh, you have two selections here 230 volts and 460 volts. <clears throat> and you have your horsepower selection all the way up to 150 horse. As you can see when you spin the wheel, uh, you get an update for your motor amperes, your breaker size, starter size, your heater, your wire size, and conduit. Now let's go back and take a look at uh, voltage drop, same thing. All you have to do is plug in your, your uh, wire length. Um, <clears throat> Let's go ahead and plug in 500 feet and let's punch in 20 amps. Hit the done button and for you can select your wiring type. Let's pick a three phase three wire and you can select uh, copper or aluminum. Currently, I only have two choices right now and uh, you have a selection of 75 degrees C. And over here, you can select your wire size and automatically gives you your voltage drop. Let's go back over here, power factor correction. Uh, just go ahead and stick in your current load that you have. Let's call it uh, 3.5 megawatts. And as you can see here, it's already calculated your capacitor KVA required to go from the existing power factor of 50% up to 75%. And if you just change this, you want to go up to a 95% power factor, uh, you'll need 4910.5 uh, kVA capacitors. You can see this is automatically dynamically updating. Uh, that's it for our first uh, video on electric power. Um, stay tuned for more videos with our other apps.